Hello and welcome to this evening's coverage of Chippenham Town versus Pool Town in the Emirates FA Cup. It's a huge occasion for both sides after an enthralling encounter ended all square at the Tatnam ground on Saturday. We have ourselves a replay at the TS Stadium where the Bluebirds will surely fancy their chances. The visitors have looked better on the road, however, and will know that it's all or nothing in tonight's clash. Well, the hosts make only one change from the side that secured the replay at the weekend, with Callum Gunner coming in for Dan Griffiths. And again, it's a side focused on attacking, with Santos, Warwick and Bunker all featuring. Poole make two changes to their starting eleven, with Jez Bedford and Luke Holmes replacing Luke Burbridge and Will Spetch. Tony Lee once more leads the line up top. Well, what an occasion here. Both sides desperate to continue in this prestigious tournament, but only one can do so. And what will this game have in store for the fans this evening? Well, Chippenham were made to come from behind at the weekend after Luke Burbridge put Pool Town ahead. Alex Bray levelling in the second half for the Bluebirds. And it's a different task completely for the visitors tonight. They'll know they'll be up against it. Chippenham flying high up towards the top end of the Vanarama National League South and Starting on the front foot here as well, winning an early free kick. Could be a dangerous position. Looks like it's going to be Harvey Bunker to take from range. We can see plenty of fans from this angle in spectation this evening. The FA Cup always provides something special. And they'll be watching on, hopefully, willing the Bluebirds on. Bunker to take from the free kick, up and over the wall and into the back of the net. Would you believe it? Chippenham Town ahead, five minutes played and it's Harvey Bunker who guides the ball beyond the reach of Mark Childs in the Pool Town goal and gives Chippenham the advantage. Five minutes played, here's the replay. A dipping, swerving effort that finds the bottom corner. Childs couldn't get anywhere near it and Bunker wheels away in celebration. What a moment for the youngster. What a moment for Chippenham Town. They have the advantage in this FA Cup tie. 1-0 upon five minutes. It's a great strike from Bunker. Totally deceiving Childs with a low effort from the free kick. What a moment for him on the FA Cup stage. And Chippenham with a breakaway opportunity here. He's got men to the right. Just delayed the overlapping pass. Is he going to pull it back for a free kick? Here he is. Poole in search of an early equaliser, but Chippenham looking to counter-attack. As the referee maybe keeps his cards in his pockets. Well, Poole have had a warning sign already from the free kick. Bunker finding the bottom corner with the last one. Can he do the same here? Steps up into the wall this time. Deflected behind. Still an attacking opportunity denied at the near post. Still not scrambled away. Still in possession. Overlapping cross from Bray. Deflected. The Dolphins clinging on as Chippenham poor bodies forward. Flipped on in the midfield. Can they finally clear? Still no. Chippenham scrapping for possession. Eventually the referee does offer some respite for Pool Town with a free kick deep inside their own half. Taken quickly towards the right-hand side. Frantic FA Cup clash this. End-to-end -end stuff as Pool try and create something of their own. Down the left-hand side, well intercepted back there from Elechi. Throw in for the visitors. They've been stunned by that early setback. Their manager would have been saying before the game, don't concede early on away soil. But they've done just that. Nothing Childs could do about that early free kick. But they'll go in search of an equaliser. Throw in, in towards the Chippenham penalty area. Easily cleared in the end. But the Dolphins pick up possession again. Play back towards the halfway line. Whips towards the far post where Bray should deal with it. Should see it out for a corner and he does. Pool starting to up the ante a little bit in the last five minutes. A little bit more attacking play from them. But Chippenham with the one goal advantage. Still a long way to go in this clash. Anything can happen in the FA Cup. But what a moment for Chippenham. What a moment to be one goal up. The fans really enjoyed that one. Corner for Poole. Swung towards the near post. Could put Henry under pressure. Shooting chance. 
but he just leant back, couldn't keep his body over the ball there, and it sails over the crossbar and to safety for Chippenham. Into the second half now, still that one goal advantage, making it nervy for the fans. Bray on the over overlap, scorer of the first Chippenham goal in this double-headed cup tie. And they nearly find an early second at the start of the second half. Joe Hanks flicked it on at the near post, just trying to catch out Mark Childs. Couldn't quite pull it off. 45 minutes away from victory and putting their name in the hat for the next round. Held up here by Warwick. Not too much support up alongside him, but he does well just to retain possession of the ball. Eventually the visitors getting a few extra numbers behind it and winning possession. Chippenham just sitting off, allowing the visitors time on the ball. They're the ones that need to do something with it. They've given it away again, and they might give away a free kick here as well, just to compound their misery, and they have... The referee gives the Bluebirds a free kick and he might go in, a, in the book there for his reaction. Jack Dixon. Well, he'll, he'll receive a yellow card for his troubles there in the FA Cup. Tempers flaring. Passion from both sets of players. You can get a feeling for that now. And they know they're running out of time here. And giving away cheap free kicks like that won't help their cause. Bluebirds with a free kick. Ross Stern to take. Ops to play it short. Might receive it on the follow back. He does. Crossing opportunity now. Swung towards the penalty area dangerously. But flicked away from Pool Town Bodies. Falls for Ross. Speculative effort and not far off. What a strike from the number 19. Might have clipped the top of the crossbar on its way through. Fine effort from him. Well, that would have been another sensational FA Cup moment for another young player. Just over the top of the bar. It wasn't a million miles off. Again, Childs scrambling over. Free kick for Pool Town now. Who are getting desperate. They know they've got little time remaining here. Just past the halfway line. Chance to get the ball towards the Chippenham box. Swung in dangerously. Flicked on. Can they feed off the scraps here? Still in possession. Deflected. Shooting chance. Great save, Henry. On the follow-up. Oh, and denied again. Somehow the ball stayed out. That's the closest we've come to an equalising goal. Still in possession. Cross deflected. Nodded on in midfield. Picked up back there. Free kick. Appeals. Waved away. Are they swung towards the Chippenham box again? Flicked on. Oh, Henry poised to make the save. And eventually the free kick's been conceded and given the way of Chippenham. God, they'll feel grateful for that. Relieve the pressure on that back line. Poole really starting to pile numbers forward and put a bit of pressure on their opposing numbers now. And that was almost an equalising goal. Great save at the back from Henry. And then they somehow couldn't force it in on the rebound. Marlon Jackson on as a sub. Maybe the manager's given him the task of just holding the ball up. Anywhere will do now for Chippenham, but he's done more than that. He's beaten a couple players. And then opted to recycle it and keep possession. And that will do it. The referee's blown the full-time whistle. And what a result that signifies for Chippenham Town. They've done it. They're through to the next round of the FA Cup. What a result decided by that early free kick from Harvey Bunker. That's enough to seal the victory. A close and cagey affair. Poole trying everything they could in the latter stages of the game to force extra time, but they couldn't find that leveller. And Chippenham have done it. They're through to the next round. What a game. What a moment for the club. It's ended here in the Emirates FA Cup qualifying stages. Chippenham Town 1, Pool Town 0.